I am Storm Tracker 18 meteorologist Jess Langlois. Another cloudy day for us here in western Wisconsin. It's been quite a few days in a row of that now. You'll notice the past few days pretty much 100% cloud cover all day long. And even earlier this week, we had a mostly cloudy to cloudy sky. And all the way back even into last weekend, we had a couple breaks here or there. But even that was pretty limited. And then going back into 2020, the last few days, rather cloudy as well. You have to go all the way back to December 29th for a day that we actually had a decent amount of sunshine. But despite the clouds today, temperatures were a couple degrees above average. We made it to 25 in Eau Claire. Mix of some upper teens just shy of 20 to low to mid 20s across the area today. Now as we add into the rest of this weekend, we are looking at clouds continuing to maintain a pretty strong hold on us. However, we do have slightly better chances to see some thinning as we go into Sunday than we have in the days leading up to this. So we are looking at a cloudy start to the day, but as we head into Sunday afternoon, we could see a few breaks of clearing in there, perhaps even some times of being partly cloudy or mostly cloudy uh, it, while uh, getting a little bit of a break from the thick, thick cloud cover that we have seen. Uh, gets fairly cloudy into Sunday evening into Monday as well, mostly cloudy again on Monday. We could see a break here or there, but at this point, Monday's looking mostly cloudy as well. So for tonight, we're looking at temperatures in the mid teens cloudy. We could be seeing some more of those areas of patchy fog. There still are some areas of lower visibility tonight, not as dense as what we have seen earlier in the week, and it's been a few days now since we've had a dense fog advisory, but still some areas of lower visibility tonight. And of course, that could be freezing fog as well with the temperatures. Tomorrow, we're looking at temperatures in the mid to upper 20s, cloudy to start the day, but we could be seeing a few of those breaks of sun into the afternoon hours were pretty quiet into the middle of the upcoming week and temperatures actually get up into the 30s. But then that Thursday into Friday time frame, we are keeping an eye on a system still a little early for that, though, but likely going to bring some slightly cooler temperatures as we head into the tail end of the upcoming week.